What's going on, his squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back. <laughs> I don't know why I said it that hard. I'm back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all lost jury, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Black Friday, more or less. Friday, November 20. Sixth, and as I say each and every video, make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, turn on all post notifications so you can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. If you guys want to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, um, any other social media, the link or the how to spell those are down in the, the description box below. It's also at the bottom left hand corner of your screen. Just look for Hitman Miyagi on uh, the main sites facebook uh twitter and uh where else youtube <laughs> I, th I think there's another one somewhere <laughs> instagram yeah that one uh and i should pop up hopefully sometimes it's together and sometimes it's spaced apart anywho uh the first things first is get to madame nazar's location if you have been looking at the map she's right here up here in grizzly's east area you know, surrounded by Oak Creek's Run, Three Sisters, and Moonstone Pond. She is right here at this location, and she will be here until 1 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know or not of America. How I personally get to her is I simply just run up from my moonshine shack, boop, talk to her real quick, and then run back or go about my day. But if you guys are not in the area, and if this, if this is your moonshine shack, just simply fast travel to your moonshine shack. Hop on your horse and run up. If it's not, fast travel to Emerald, Sta Emerald Station, Emerald Ranch. And this, go up there from here. Just mark your waypoint right here at this location. And she's right there. Right there at that location. Boom. Super simple. <laughs> um, next thing I want to get to is the Caribbean Rum Antique Alcohol Bottle, which is where the red brick road leads to right here at the end of this waypoint inside this first tent you guys will find the antique alcohol bottle caribbean rum right here at this location go inside the tent towards the back i think there's a barrel right here and that's where you will find the caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle the antique alcohol bottle is used as a madame nazar location uh, or you can use it for as a recipe for the moonshine shot. Let's get to these cycles. The cycles are kind of, I guess, is is weird to me. Why are you being weird to me? Cycles is um, <laughs> it's a little bit different because I'm used to everything being all mixed up, all kinds of numbers. But everything is one number except like two two uh categories. So. Everything is cycle four except for wildflowers and fossils. And those both are cycle five. So if you guys can follow um, the cycles for today, Friday, November 26th are family heirloom cycle four. All lost jury cycle four, coin cycle four, arrowhead cycle four, wildflower cycle five, antique alcohol bottle cycle four, all tear card cycle four, bird egg cycle four, and fossils cycle five. Remember to check the description box just in case you did not get that in any kind of way. Check the description box below because everything will be down there for you guys. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and cash out for the channel. Let's get to these things that we will find across the Lemoyne area real quick. Just get it out the way. I don't I don't think I, I want to go into too much detail, but right here between the M and A of Marsh, right here at this location be below this mark right here. If you guys can see that very faint mark. It's right below that. Right here at this location, you guys will get a fossil. This fossil is randomized. I cannot tell you what it is, but come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will dig up. A random fossil there's also a random arrowhead right here at this location between the shoreline and a couple trees i think there's like two or three trees pull out your metal detector in this area and you will get a random 
arrowhead right here at this location let's go over to our next marker which is a coin this coin is randomized as well come right here at this location at the base of the dead tree that's sticking out of the ground with your metal detector and that's what you will get a random fossil let's go over to the left a little bit by the word lacay on the left of the word lacay right here at the back of this shack you guys will see a family heirloom, which is a goat hairbrush. This goat hairbrush is at the back of the shack on a bench. So simply just grab it and keep it pushing. Um, let's go over to our left a little bit more to this shack here. Go inside this shack. Go, I guess, kind of towards the back on the right hand side. You guys should see a seven of um, a seven of nothing. It's a king of swords hair card. So go and grab that as well. And that is part of the um, Squire's journey for Madame Nazar. So go and get that. Let's go over here to our next location, which we can stop here, right here. By this shoreline, there's a tree. And in that tree, you guys should see bars. A heron egg, H-E-R-O-N. It's, an, it's an, in the tree, shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Let's continue our journey to the right and inside this cemetery here, you guys will see a fam, not a family, anything, a lost jury. This lost jury is not a random lost jury. It's a Benet's Topaz ring. It's inside this crypt here, go straight through the gate and towards the back where there's a little shelf area. And on that shelf, you will be able to grab the Benet's Topaz ring. While you're in the cemetery, there's also a tarot card here right next to the fire. This tarot card is a two of swords. When that's there, there's a card right here by this sheet. This card is a king of cups. And this next marker here is another tarot card as well. Right here at this location, you guys will get a four of cups. This four of cups is on a box near a fountain with a light right here at this location. Right here by the D and the knee. Across from the saloon, as you can see to the left, in this little area, there's a wall. But right before you get to the wall, there's a little opening, like a little gate that you can push open. And on the other side of that gate, you should see a table. And on that table, you guys will get a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a ivory hairpin. So go and grab that. Right here below the word saint, there's a little area right here. And in this backyard, you see a lot of patio furniture, like chairs and tables and stuff like that. Uh, right here on the table of this backyard, you guys will get a family heirloom, another family heirloom, which this is a cherry wood comb. It's right here at this location, so go and grab that as well. Uh, down here at our next location the, of our next marker is a... Antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is a Tennessee whiskey bottle. How to get that is go through the gate here. Uh, hop on this platform here. You should see an entrance into the building here. Go through that entrance and follow the path down and around to about right here, which is where the antique alcohol bottle is. This antique alcohol bottle is sitting on a very large crate, kind of in the middle of the path. So just grab the antique alcohol bottle and Reverse. Go back the other way that you came from. Hop on your horse and let's go over here to this next location, which you can come down here, right here. There's a little small little area you can uh, pull your horse down and run over to this location to grab this um, flower, which that's what this is. This marker is. This is a flower. Uh, this flower is a cardinal flower. This cardinal flower spawns over here in this area each and every day. And by its exact location, it tells me exactly what cycle the flowers are on for today. And today is cycle five, as I said. Um, let's go over here to our next marker, which is a arrowhead. Come over here to this location of this marker with your metal detector. And that's what you will dig up. A random arrowhead. You do need your metal detector to find it. But look at the base of, of the large tree that's over here. There's a couple other trees, but the biggest tree. We'll go up to that tree. You should be able to know what tree it is by looking at the grass. It looks like the grass is cut in this area. Like really low. <laughs> Excuse me. So that's just an indication for you guys. Just in case you didn't know. I think I did mention that before. In the actual Braithwaite Manor home, before we get here, Right here by this dot 
in front of this outhouse, pull out your metal detector, you will get a random coin. I cannot tell you what it is because it is randomized. On this little peak right here, pull out your metal detector once again, and you will get a random lost jury. It's in front of a big tree right here at this location. So go and grab that. But as I was saying, in front of the Braithwaite Manor home, or not in front, but inside the Braithwaite Manor home, on the second floor, first room to the left, on the mantle of the fireplace, you guys will get a jade hairpin. So go up the stairs and look in the first room to the left. As soon as you go up to the stairs, turn left and go in that first room. On the mantle, like on top of the fireplace, you should see a jade hairpin family heirloom. That's there. Boom. Uh, I have a couple more things inside of roads, which are ba basically tarot cards. There's a tarot card right here on a table at this location. This tarot card is a six of cups. And there's another tarot card inside this little room right here. You can't go into the big area of the house, but you can go into the like the side room. Go right there and inside this little side room on the work table, you guys will find a nine of pentacles tarot card. And while you're still over here in this area, right about here, you guys will find um, a big pile of rocks and pull out your metal detector right here at this location. And what you will dig up or hit on is a random lost jury. So go and grab that as well. Uh, at our last marker right here above Matic Pond at this farmhouse with all the cows and stuff right here inside this house, you guys will get. A family heirloom. This family heirloom is a New Guinea rosewood hairbrush. This New Guinea rosewood hairbrush is in a chest in the bedroom. So go and grab that as well. Um, that's pretty much it for all the extras and stuff that I do have for you guys. The cycles for today, once again, are for today. I feel like I have to say this. Friday, November 26th, once again, are. Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Laws Jury Cycle 4, Coin Cycle 4, Arrowhead Cycle 4, Wildflower Cycle 5, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Tear Cards, All Tear Cards Cycle 4, <laughs> Bird Egg Cycle 4, and Fossil Cycle 5. <laughs> Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there for you guys. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the Twitter, Instagram, Facebook and cash out for the channel. Uh, thank you guys for watching, looking, listening, liking, sharing, subscribing, commenting and everything else you do for the channel. I do appreciate it so, so much. If you haven't, if you don't remember to like, share, subscribe, turn on all post notifications so you guys can get each and every video that I put out. Because I put out videos each and every day. <sighs> it's your main man, Hitman, once again with another video. And I'm out. I had to remember. <laughs> it, like I had to think, like, did I say everything? Because I feel like I'm going kind of fast. But I'm out. <laughs>